Hello guys, uh, this is Sam from ComperFix.info uh, Today I just want to show you uh, the Sony Vegas Pro uh, and I'll be using, I'll first use the Adobe After Effects and the next tutorial I'll be showing you how to do this on Sony Vegas Pro and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make a snowy effect uh, This is a still image uh, I took when there was snow outside and I want to make um, uh, as if uh, it's a video with uh, snow falling uh, to do this, uh, you just need to follow my steps as usual. Uh, thanks, guys. Please hit the subscribe button for more tricks and tutorials. Uh, to do this, uh, you also need to on, on sorry, on Adobe After Effects. Uh, you 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 go on, you click on your on your layer, uh, the image layer, and you go on effect. Uh, then go on simulation and go on snowfall. And the next thing you do uh, is, um, sorry guys, uh, you go on effects, uh, you go on simulation, and then you go on snow. Uh, the next thing you want to do uh, is to change all the settings of the snow. Uh, the size you change as well. And let's play this uh, a sec. Uh, you see, uh, it's it's the store is falling uh, and you can increase the size and let's play and the, the, the wind direction as well uh, you can change the wind direction and let's play Uh, the next thing we want to do uh, on this uh, is to make um, um, a, a very very uh, useful tool uh, to make it to to look realistic uh, to do this. Um, what you do next uh, is to go on effects and then go on color correction and you go on on hue and saturation. And the thing you want to do uh, when this window pops up uh, is to must on the master situation uh, drag that to minus 100 and and the master lightness uh, just move it up a little bit and and um, and close the box and the next thing you do is uh, the next thing you do uh, guys on after you've done this uh, is to go on layer and go on you. Uh, and then solid uh, you have to choose white for this choose white and and okay and hit okay uh, this will come up and the best thing you want to do uh, is to man to to choose Uh, on this rectangle tool, uh, we're not supposed to choose the rectangle tool. We choose supposed to choose the set over tool. Uh, to do this, uh, we just click on that and choose uh, the ellipse tool. And the, the thing you want when you choose the ellipse tool, uh, the thing you want to do next is is to just uh, draw around it. Uh, it looks like there was a mistake. Sorry, guys. Uh, you choose the oval tool and you just draw around it, and this uh, it will be like that. And the next thing you want to do uh, is uh, the next thing you want to do uh, is to go on effect and then blur and sharpen, and then you choose uh, the Gaussian blur. And what you want to do uh, on this uh, is to blurriness or uh, make it as high as you can as really really high and the next thing you do uh, is uh, the next thing I want you to do uh, is to press T on your keyboard uh, and you will bring the opacity property of the white solid uh, and the thing you want to do uh, is to just drag this down uh, maybe like that uh, and the next thing you do uh, is uh, let's just see how it's like.
yeah it's working out all right and the thing that we want to do next uh is uh as i said uh if you if you begin to play you can uh like move uh to where you want this to be like showing uh, I think it will be better here and uh, there are so many things you can do uh, to make a snowy effect after your movie uh, please subscribe to my channel there's more tricks yet to still yet to come I uh, really appreciate your comments uh, please comment below and and say your views guys uh, this is like um, and l let me just play this uh, there are so many things you can do uh, you you know for the snowy effect uh, you can do a lot of things um, it can do a lot of things a lot of things guys are s serious a lot of things uh, so that's it guys uh we can preview it uh from the beginning thanks very much i'll put this on youtube uh just not r right now and please subscribe and comment uh there's a link uh, at the bottom of this tutorial uh please just click on the link and it'll take you to the finished version of this snowy effect thanks very much uh take care of yourselves bye